Okay. Assalamualaikum. Hello everybody. Safura, come to Safura's kitchen. We're going to cook today. Uh, bihun biryani. Uh, bihun biryani, that means a prawn bihun biryani. Okay, let's start now. The ingredient here. Ghee, ginger and garlic paste. Salmon and mix. And we have a uh, three tablespoon of uh, mixed chicken masala, two tablespoon of uh, tomato paste. We have some salt. We have uh, onion, tomato, yogurt, and uh, we have the paste of uh, ginger. Uh, what is uh, what you call it? Coriander and ah uh, um, uh, 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 the leaf is blended. It's blended, two spoon or so, all is blended and cut, easier to move. Okay, now we start our cooking here. We'll start. We'll put the two tablespoons of the ghee. Then we stir. Then we'll put the mix. Cinnamon and other things. Mix together. This is it. You see. Then we have the onion. We'll go inside now. Have you try? Smell nice also because of the ghee. If you don't, you all don't like ghee. You all can use even oil, any cooking oil, but not much. But the taste is because of the biryani. Taste is the uh, uh, ghee. Hello, Chef. I think happy. Then we're going to put in our masala inside. Curry masala, mixed one. Then straight away, we're going to pour some water inside. We don't want the, burn, the masala to be burnt. <laughs> don't put a lot of water also. You see the bihun? You see the bihun that much? This at least about five people can eat. For dinner, for lunch or for other occasion, you all increase the recipe. Okay, so they put in the tomato, the tomato, then your yogurt, two spoon of yogurt, mint and mint and uh, uh, cocktail, uh, uh, which uh, brine one, leaf together. And your ginger garlic paste as well. We got two spoon here, tablespoon. You can do it in anything. You can do it in chicken, you can do it in mutton. Mutton must well look well boiler. Chicken. Even you can do it in fish, you have to fry the fish because the fish will break. Prawn no need. And then you have the paste of uh, tomato paste. So two spoon. Salt a little bit. As much you want need the salt a little bit. You fry it again. Let the masala to cook for a while.
can see the masala is boiling. The set already can stir it. Make it center. Stir one more time. The smell start coming out. Smells good. I'm going to taste the masala a little bit. Is it okay enough? Salt. Then I'm going to put in now the prawn inside. Let it cook. I have some extra prawn I'm putting inside. So five to six people are going to eat. Now I'm going to put in the bihun. I'm going to put in the bihun. I'm studying. Studying the bihun. Even you all want the yellow noodle also can do. Won't be a problem. Or you want to do in Koichia also can. But the best is the bihun. This is the olden days style. This is my mom's recipe. When I was young, my mom used to make. And some of my sisters don't know also. make make and give but now every all of them can make all of them can cook bihun biryani you see it's done like that but bihun you have to cut a little bit after you boil it then only easy for you to stir stir it well it's a little bit must be a little bit soggy not too dry, it'll be soggy, then will be very nice. You see a prawn? Any prawn. Any prawn you can do it. Any prawn you can do it. Now Ready? It's ready. I'm going to remove. I'm 
I'm going to remove it. Now I'm going to take it out. Today our house we're going to have dinner this. And I'm a fast so so today I'm pasta. So I'm going to have a good dinner. You all also must try. And please comment. If you like, share. It's big, big prawn. This is even my daughter-in-law's favorite. She likes. So during the fasting month also I did never do. I got no time to do. So now we are doing the prawn. After this, you layer. You see how it look. Now I garnishing. I garnishing with the soup leaf. Garnishing with the soup leaf. Yeah, I make. How is it? Anything? Please comment and share with people. Thank you. Assalamualaikum. Bye.